Hello everyone, in this video, I will show you some best free FPS games for PC in 2021. So without any further ado let's start this video. The first game of this video is Quake Champions. ID Software is the king of first-person shooters, playing a pivotal role in their development in the 90s. Few games were more influential during that time than Quake. The lightning-fast shooter put reflexes and skill above all else, becoming a popular early eSport and spawning several sequels. With Quake Champions, which went free to play in August 2018, it delivers classic Quake action at a speed you can only get on PC. Next up we have Valorant. Riot Games is no stranger to the free-to-play genre, focusing most of its history on League of Legends before moving on to a slew of mobile games. Valorant is its latest attempt, and although it keeps the MOBA roots of the studio, it adds first-person action into the mix. The hybrid MOBA FPS is just getting started, with its second competitive season launching just days ago, bringing a deathmatch mode and more to the game. Next up we have Team Fortress 2. Boasting beautifully rendered graphics and a well-balanced class system, the lauded Team Fortress 2 still appeals to casual gamers and pros alike, garnering what is one of the largest player bases on Steam more than seven years after its initial debut. The game is a steadfast hybrid of fast-paced combat, an intense strategy in which every one of the game's nine classes exhibits its own powerful strengths and crippling weaknesses. Next up we have Splitgate Arena Warfare. Splitgate Arena Warfare is another attempt at a modern take on the FPS genre, this time in the form of a tactical team-based shooter, rather than a BR. Splitgate is an arena shooter that's reminiscent of Halo. The dev team is made up of several Halo 3 veterans, so the similarities aren't coincidental. Next up we have The Cycle. If you're looking for something fundamentally different from most other free FPS games out there, The Cycle might be worth checking out. It's an Epic Games Store exclusive developed and published by Yager of Spec Ops The Line and Dreadnought fame. The Cycle is a unique quest-based PvPV multiplayer shooter. Next up we have Ring of Elysium. Battle Royale games are a dime a dozen these days, but Tencent mixes up the formula in Ring of Elysium by providing another option for those not interested in mowing down other players' escape. Set on a snowy mountain in the middle of a massive storm, you and up to three other players can survive certain death, either by the weather or other players, by boarding a rescue helicopter. Next up we have Counter-Strike Global Offensive. No list of the best FPS games would be complete without Counter-Strike. A pioneer in the competitive gaming scene, Counter-Strike Global Offensive has taken the genre staple to new heights over the years, bringing skill and strategy to the shooter scene and introducing it to PC newcomers used to dolphin dives and tactical nukes. And the move to a F2P formula in late 2018 is only broadening its reach. Next up we have Ironsight. Players could have a difficult time distinguishing this game from Call of Duty just through screenshots alone. Even reviews on Steam make the game seem like it's a cost-effective clone of the game. It's often compared to a newer, updated version of Black Squad. It could be a fun challenge for loyal COD players. Ironsight launched right at the end of 2019. The holiday release played out like most holiday releases. Next up we have Warface. Crytek has been developing first-person shooters for nearly two decades, and the company's experience has shown with polished and flashy games that feel just as good on console as they do on PC. Most free-to-play first-person shooters focus exclusively on competitive multiplayer, but Warface also features a cooperative mode that rewards you for completing missions and playing well as a team. The last game of this video is Paladins Champions of the Realm. Blizzard's Overwatch remains the king of the hero shooter multiplayer genre, but high-res studios Paladins Champions of the Realm is a great alternative for those who don't want to sink $40 before they've even begun playing. Much like in Overwatch, you select from dozens of different characters spread across multiple classes such as damage, flanker, support, and frontline, each offering a different style of play that can help your team to victory. So that's the list of the 10 best free FPS games for PC that you can play in 2021. If you enjoy this video, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel GamesPuff, and press the bell icon for more gaming updates.